to the channel and this video is on the power of makeup and yeah so um, I've been seeing this tag um, all around YouTube and Twitter and Facebook and everything like that and it's um, talking about like the power of makeup and like a lot of people say and I'm going to be quoting Nikki um, make a Nikki tutorials because I saw her video and it went viral and it was amazing so I'm gonna leave the link to her channel down below so you can see that um, and yeah I um, was seeing that you know a lot of people feel negatively negatively <laughs> a lot of people feel negatively about makeup and um, how you use it just to like look good for others or to cover something up or to be someone who you're not and like if you're insecure about yourself so you're gonna slap makeup on just to create somebody else and, or you do it because you really don't care about yourself and you just want to be somebody else but you know for me um, makeup is fun you know like I love makeup because it's so much fun there's like always a new palette out there there's always a new product to try there's always something new to do like there's a new type of smoky eye there's a new type of eyeliner and I just feel like that's so much fun I love anything that has to do with art and makeup is an art it's a form of expression and it just comes from the out from within you and you know like you just put it on yourself so you can show the world who you are it's not you know to cover up who you are not you know um, or you know just to cover up anything that you don't want other people to see but for me I really um, enjoy makeup I think it's beautiful I think it's fun I feel like you can be as many different versions of yourself as you can because you can do a blue eyeliner today and tomorrow you're gonna have a smoky eye and then maybe tomorrow and the day after that you might want to like emphasize the shape of your lips so you're gonna do a bright red lipstick or something like that and honestly that doesn't make you any less of a woman or any less of a person it just makes you um, creative it makes you happy and different so I mean if you if just because other people don't want to stand out doesn't mean that you can't stand out because you want to show the world who you are from within and it's a form of art like I said so you're just um, releasing your inner artist so I hope that this tutorial will help you and open those doors for you and you know like if you're feeling a little bit nervous about you know delving into the makeup world then really don't feel that way because honestly um, makeup is just gonna make you look more beautiful and emphasize those um, features that you already have and you know that you're proud of because that if you were so insecure about yourself you would never leave your house so you know I hope that this video is um, informative I'm just gonna be doing half of my face so you'll see half all made up and the other half with nothing all bare so you could see everything and yeah I hope that you enjoy it um, and so anyway I use foundation because it evens out my skin tone I have acne and um, as it heals it always leaves these dark marks behind so this is why I use foundation to even out my skin tone and make it look more beautiful so let's get started with that The foundation I used was um, the MAC Match Master um, it, with SPF 15 and it is a broad spectrum um, with SPF 15 and it is in the color 6.0. The next thing I'm going to use is concealer. I use concealer because um, I have dark circles as you can see and they make me look tired and they also make me look older and lit and sad so I like to cover them up because I have a bubbly personality I'm always smiling and I'm always smiling and I'm very friendly and um, concealer just helps um, that and concealer helps to portray that part of my about my personality and for my eyebrows I'm gonna be using the Bobbi Brown's eyeshadow in mahogany um, and this brush from Anastasia to fill them in and I do my brows because I never had enough brows and they both are from their different shapes so it just want I just use them to fill them in um, all the sparse areas that I have and just to make them a little bit more even okay um, and I'm going to be using the Mac mineralized skin finish and dark and that's just to set um, the products that I put on my face already and then be using um, a MAC brush this fluffy brush to apply it all over now I'm going to be using um, the MAC um, Pro Long Wear paint pot in the color painterly to start off with the eyeshadow now I'm going to be using the Naked palette the Naked Basics 2 
and I'm going to start doing eyeshadow. And eyeshadow, I use it because I like to play up the shape of my eyes. I like to contour them because I, when I'm smiling like this, like my eyes look really small and they look squinty. And I don't really like the, the whole squinty then because I smile like this and then my eyes look really small. So using eyeshadow helps to play up the shape of my eyes and just makes them more beautiful. And I'm going for a natural look today. I'm going to smoke out the outer corners to make my eyes look larger. I'm going to put a little bit of highlight under the eyebrow. This will just help to open up the whole eye area. I'm also going to use the shade in the inner corner. Now I'm going to smoke out my lower lash line. Now I'm going to be watering my water Watering? Now I'm going to be filling in my waterline using um, Stila's Smudge Stick Waterproof Eyeliner in the color Gilded. So, um, I'm going to be doing contour now and I'm going to be using Anastasia's Contour Kit in the, in the shade Medium Tan. Um, I contour my face because it sculpts it. It makes it look a little bit more edgy. And I'm going to finish up the eyes in a second after I do this. And it gives me like more shape and definition to my face. Now I'm going to be using some um, bronzer just to awaken, uh, um, wake, awaken my skin tone because sometimes I tend to look sallow. So I like to look alive and happy and refreshed. Now I'm going to be um, using some blush and it is from NARS and it is the color Orgasm. And this just makes my face look a lot more alive, healthy, and because I don't usually look pink or blush. So that helps me look alive and well you know, healthy. So yeah, that's why I'm going to do that. And for the highlight, I'm going to be using the NARS Albatross just on the, the cheekbones and a little bit in the inner corner of the eye. Now I'm going to be finished, I'm going to finish up with the eyes and I'm going to be lining the top lashes um, using the Milani Infinite Liquid Eyeliner. And I do eyeliner because it helps to make my eyes look larger and more expressive and more awake. Now I'm going to be using the Stardell lashes. Um, I'm going to be using um, the number SF02 in the black. And I'm going to be applying them to my eyes just to make them look a lot bigger. I'm now going to be using some mascara and this is from Urban Decay in the Perversion and I'm going to use this just to mix my lashes with the falsies. I'm going to be using this lip lip pencil from MAC in the color Spice because as you can see my lips have two different tones and I would like for them to have the same color. So I'm going to be using this lipstick from MAC and it's in the color, in the color Ruby Woo. Last but not least, I'm going to be using is a Dior Addict lip gloss. So there you have it girls. This is my power of makeup look. I hope that you guys enjoyed it and that you feel confident in using makeup um, going forward. And just make yourself have fun with it. This is something that is a part of you. So as usual, I want to give you guys a kiss, a hug, and see you guys next time. Bye.